Hello, this video will be a continuation of a previous video I made in which I discuss the commercialization of golden rice by the Philippines. Now, as with anything new, there are both positives that can be drawn and also negatives. For all the positives of golden rice, that hasn't stopped some people from criticizing the move to commercialize the product. People argue that the Philippines commercializing golden rice will hurt local farmers. That is, the manufacturers of the golden rice seed, they argue, will have a monopolistic power over them. They argue that local farmers will be placed at a disadvantage relative to the crops they would normally produce. Now, although this may be true, there are costs and benefits to everything. So if we apply the same logic to golden rice, I can argue that even though local farmers may experience some temporary hardships due to their change in crop, that does not outweigh the potential massive health benefits that their local population will have as a result of the golden rice commercialization. For people to just dismiss the nutritional benefits of golden rice in favor of keeping a farmer's livelihood the same is not the way things go. In all industries, there's a propensity for progress. One must recognize this and do their best to seamlessly transition into the new era of that industry. The more help governments can give to industries, not just the farming industry in this case, but all industries, the more likely it is that societies around the globe will see steady progress in the form of not only economic prosperity, but also increased global health. 